So I don't quite know what's going on with this guy. Um, his eyes, if, if you notice, they're moving. He, he's looking around. I, I don't... Jimmy? Jimmy? J Jimmy? J Jimmy, are you are you are you alive? You're just kind of laying there, chilling out. I don't really know how to take that. Oh, oh. Is it over? It is. Is he dead? I don't know. Let's find out. Oh man. Oh Jesus Christ. Um. Okay. You know, I'm not really one for poking with a dead stick. Uh mentality, but you know, we're gonna poke him with a stick. Yeah, this is my buddy Jimmy. He, he, he's been dead. Uh, Leopard killed him. Okay, so we're just gonna take Jimmy, and uh, we're gonna bring him back to his family. Oh, uh, God. Um, we're gonna bring him back to his hut. He, 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 was, he was over here. He was doing some pottery, and we're gonna do what we can for him and his family. Oh, dear. I destroyed his little... All, his life's work has just been completely destroyed. But, you know, there's only one thing we can do in this situation. And that is, uh... Here rest poor Jimmy. He was a hero. Uh, okay, now the body's not burning properly. Clearly. My friend's burning. My little tiger friend's burning. Apologize for that. But, um, so clearly... We're doing something wrong here. Um, so we're gonna take the body, and we're uh, gonna go you know, on a journey. Uh, so we're gonna. Uh, right. We're gonna go on a journey. Right. So we're gonna go to our nearest little base. Um, it's over here, and we're gonna have a lovely uh, funeral in his honor. Now I know this might seem strange, you know. I mean. Be just carrying this dead card. Poor Jimmy here. He had a wife and like five kids, I think. I don't know. Marriage wasn't actually that common in the Stone Age. There's a tall elk. Um, that's why actually why I'm here. I've been hunting for a rare tall elk in order to use them. You see here, um, uh, this guy, he requires a rare elk skin. I have the one I need, but I don't have this guy. Okay, this elk seems to be perturbed slightly. Um, Apparently I have to kill and search a carrier, but you know, I think Jimmy here takes priority. But it appears we're gonna come across these guys anyway. So uh, yup. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna freedom. This is for Jimmy. And uh, his loved ones. So we just uh, take that. Now is Jimmy still around? Cause he threw his body down around here. Jimmy's still there. How are your eyes, Jimmy? Still closed. Um, I wonder if any of these guys had the same problem. Nope, he seems perfectly now. Oh God. So uh, these guys aren't obviously aren't suffering from the same problem as uh, Jimmy over there. Yep, they're completely not. Wait, wait, wait. See that? His eyes are open slightly, but he isn't moving. So, um, I don't know what to take from that. My, my guy's eating his meat, you know. It's kind of disgusting. Anyway, back to Jimmy. Uh, come on, buddy. Uh, proper funeral does await you. Unfortunately, you cannot run with said body. Um, oh god, I think this is, this is Billy, I think he was a friend of Jimmy. Billy, um, hey, hey, Billy. I don't know how to tell you this, but, Jimmy's dead. Oh, okay, I guess you didn't like Jimmy, asshole. Fucking hell, what a prick. He's probably banging his wife, that's what's probably going on right there. I'll bet you that's what's going on. How fucking inconsiderate can that guy be? Fucking Billy, man. A lot of illies, um, in the, uh, Winja clan. It's, uh, it, it's hard, it's hard to explain the reasoning for that. But a lot of people believe it's due to the, uh, um, you see here the illies are sort of inbreeders. If you, if you catch my drift. I think the base is up there. 
I could be wrong, of course. Let's just let's just go check our map. Uh, cave outpost. Okay, my bad. So it's actually in the cave. Well, that's good. He deserves a proper funeral, and a proper funeral he gets. So we're gonna go into the cave. Ignore the tusks. They're not there for any particular reason. And uh, we're just gonna go up the hill. Um, that, that's a good place for a funeral right there. But we're not gonna do it over there. Okay, we're gonna do it. Okay, there. Here's my bed. And look at that. Is that not a perfect funeral pyre? So we're gonna go in here. Oh, well, I don't know about this. This is pretty spacious. Um. Ah, excellent. A cage. So um. First thing first, we gotta break open the cage. Okay. I hope no one's gonna be angry about this. We don't really keep any prisoners here. Um, but you know, like I said, you know, it, he deserves a proper burial. And so, Jimmy, I wish you an everlasting hope and everlasting fiery. And you know, you were a good friend. I didn't really know you that well. Okay, I caught on fire good. But, um. Can you not? He can't actually catch on fire. He, he was known as Jimmy the Fireproof, so I guess that's why they called him that. I didn't realize that was a literal interpretation. Um, but no, this is an honoring of our fallen comrade, uh, Jimmy. Yeah. I, I don't, I, I, I guess I should say a few words. Um, Jimmy was, oh, there's nobody here. Well, I guess I'll just talk to my cat. So Jimmy was a brave man. Um, he fought with dignity against the snow leopard. The snow leopard lived. I didn't want to kill it. I didn't have any reason to. I got all my leopard skin. Um, lived on and went, and I don't know where the leopard is now. I don't know if you killed. Did you kill the leopard? Yeah, that's what I thought. Um, I just... He fought with such dignity, and you know, I've always been impressed by him, and that, that everlasting eyes. Glimpse in his eye... Wait, what, what the fuck? Do you see that? His eyes, they're, they're slightly open, but they're black. He's a fucking demon! Kill it! Kill it! No! Kill it! No!